Well, in January last year, uh, Fire Chief and I got together with the advisory board and realized that our buildings were no longer yeah. efficient and safe for our community and for uh, firefighters and police officers. So we put together uh, a warrant article for study. And the study's been complete, and, and basically the study confirms what we thought, that uh, you know, for ultimate fire coverage in Pembroke to, to increase our services to where they need to be done, we really need to have two-man stations, and the, the police station needs to move from its facility to what will be the vacated fire headquarters. And, and again, it's a very common sense plan. Uh, we're putting together the, uh, the reasons why, and we know why, and now we have to figure out how, and that's what we're going to be doing over the winter time. And where, where can people get more information about that? Well, we're going to have several meetings over the next several months, from between now and, and springtime meeting. We hope to hit all the, you know, social groups in town, Democratic, you know, Republican Party committees, uh, Dell Men's Club, uh, really anybody who wants to get together. We're going to have a couple of public forums also to really get into depth what the report said. Uh, last night was just a snippet. Um, you know, we had a time frame, might have gone over it a little bit, but um, there's really a lot more to be tell, told about the, the needs and the assessment. Um, in the needs, the study will be put on the town website. We're actually starting a, uh, a whole section for the buildings so that people can win. If they missed last night, they missed town meeting, shame on them, they should have been there. Uh, it was a good town meeting. But uh, all of that information will be on there. There will be PowerPoints on the conditions of both the police and the fire station present. And we'll be updating that with whatever information uh, the committees come to, uh, to put on. So town website and the, the Pembroke Police website will also have the same information. Okay. Right. Anything else? They spoke it so eloquently, I, I don't dare mess it up. Very, very common sense. It's something that we have to do. It's not something that we really want to do. I mean, it's a lot of extra work and everything else. But like everything else, when, when you're faced with a problem, you have to come up with a solution. And that's what we're working on right now. Yep. So stay tuned. Yeah. There's other towns in the area that have recently done the same. Where, so like Duxbury, I'm thinking, you know, they had a really right. small police department. You know, over the last 10 years, Hanover, Duxbury, uh, Situate, Situate yeah. Middlebar was in the process of it. <laughs> Plimpton's getting a new, uh, a new police station. I mean, because the facilities, you know, are over 40 years old, and the technology changes, and, and the needs changes in the last 40 years have been tremendous. So we're just trying to keep up with that. Okay, thank you.